Hey guys, what's up? It's Reagan and welcome back to my channel. Today is finally the day that I'm going to be detangling it. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to deep condition overnight if I feel like doing all that at one time, like washing it, but we'll see. Because I don't know how I'm going to style it after um, I end up washing it, but we will see. I might just do something easy. So the first thing that I'm going to do, I've already separated it, but I'm just going to spray it with a little bit of water. I'm probably going to split this section up too, just to make it go a little bit easier. Okay, so yeah, I'm going to split this one up as well. So... Like I said before, I had, I got my um, passion twist taken down and then I just had her put some twists in and I kept those like medium sized twists in for about a week and then I took it down and was just wearing my hair like in a puff or down or whatever. So it looks like I have dreads, like I don't know if you can see, but like like these little pieces they're very tightly coiled so I just want to take my time and detangle really well before I wash it which is what I do every time pretty much so I got all my ingredients <laughs> I have my conditioner this isn't like the healthiest most natural um, conditioner but it does have a lot of slip and this is what I use to like pre detangle if you will so what I do is I just put some on my section and then I'll just start using my fingers to detangle. I hardly ever use a comb or a brush like a dimming brush to detangle my hair unless I'm going for like a super defined look. For the most part, I just like to use my hands or my fingers so I can feel the knots. And then I just pull them apart. I'm put a little bit more water. Jaden is playing in his crib. While I do this, oh, okay. Let me put the sound back on for him. There you go. <laughs> Okay, that wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. Granted, my hairstylist, she did like thoroughly detangle my hair extremely well. So I would say this section is pretty much detangled. Yeah! And after I can run my fingers through it, that's how I know. And you can see how defined it is. My lighting is not the best. You see how defined my curls are. And this is all of the shed hair that I got from that section. And that's it. And now I'm just gonna do that process on my whole head. And I'll just twist the section that I finish. Okay guys, wow. I am really shocked at how, oh, let me pause this one. Oh, that's what we need to do, okay. Okay, I'm really shocked at how smoothly this is going. I've already detangled 75%? Yeah, 75% of my head. So um, the, the front sections and then this back section, I had to divide it into three sections. And when you separate your hair, 
your natural hair into sections, it just makes it go a lot smoother and you're able to like tang finger detangle faster, at least for me. So I just have one more section left. Hallelujah. And Jaden is being an angel. Aren't you a cutie booty? He's being such a good baby. He is a good baby, but he's just like playing with his toys and watching um listening to nursery rhymes. Okay, so like I said, this back part of my hair is just I have a lot of hair. It's very dense and coily, so I just separated it into oh it's, it's it hurts honestly to separate it because <laughs> the curls are so close together. I'm just gonna separate it into three sections. If you watch my crochet video, then you know that I had that crochet in from like December to February, I wanna say. Yeah, February. Was it February? Yeah. And um, yeah, that was a long time. I was really surprised, but the crochet was just so comfortable and I got it washed in between, so my scalp was happy but i have a lot of new growth i can tell because my hair is like really really defined not that it wasn't before but it just looks like like it really needed that <laughs> that break because while i was pregnant i neglected my hair i'm not even gonna lie and then one day i was so fed up that i just chopped a lot of it off <laughs> i was like i can't do this and i needed a trim so Got a knot right back here. See it? I'm not gonna yank it out. I'm just gonna separate the hair. And it should just come out. Yeah, it went out like butter. And this is all that came out. That's it. I'm finally done detangling my hair. This is all of the shed hair that I got. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, and this is it. So as you can see, super juicy and soft. Yeah. Okay, and now I'm just gonna layer my deep conditioner. This is the Shea Moisture, Jamaican Black Castor Oil, oil. It has shea butter, peppermint, apple cider vinegar. I've been using Shea Moisture since I started my hair journey. So. I'm gonna put this all over my scalp. Cause like I said, it was like really dry. And y'all know that feeling when you're, when you're just, when you're overdue to wash your hair. It just feels crusty and and then I sometimes scratch it and that's not good. So this will make it feel so much better. Make sure I got all my ends. Let me show you this. I need to get more of this mask. Oh, it feels so good. Okay, and then my hairstylist, she made this natural oil. What? She made this um, scalp oil. It's like all natural. So I'm gonna just drench this all over my ends. And my scalp too. She said it has peppermint oil. Um, I forgot what else she said. I think jojoba oil. Oh my God, that feels so good. <laughs> um, I don't know, but I love it. Cause I tried other oils, but they're just too heavy for my scalp. <laughs> And she said it, you can even put it on your skin. So I love that. Okay, I'm blind, but I don't have my contacts on. Okay. So 
So that's all I'm gonna do for now. Till I check back in. I'm just gonna wrap my, or just put this in a bun to marinate. And put a cap on. Oh, shit. Okay, I'm just using a plastic cap and then I'm gonna just put this on top. So we can get all hot and steamy. And that's a wrap. Until I wash it. Could be tonight, could be tomorrow. <laughs> you guys will just have to wait and see. Huh, Bubba? He's just staring at me. I love you so much. <laughs> oh, yes, I do. <laughs> okay. All right, y'all, I have an appointment, but I just wanted to show that I'm still, my camera's about to die, that I'm still um, deep conditioning. <laughs> while I go to my appointment, I just put this little beanie on that I've been having for a while, and I, <laughs> I kind of did my edges, but since I have like the, all of the product in my hair, it's not really sticking, so I just use water. Like, what is this? It's just trying to curl back up, but it's fine until I end up washing it when I get back um, later today. Okay, guys, I'm back. I finally washed my hair, y'all. Wow, <laughs> this has been a journey. So I tried a couple of new products. I'll just add some clips to show you guys, but I tried Trader Joe's shampoo and conditioner. I loved both of them. The shampoo, and conditioner it's like a tea tree and eucalyptus mix so that was perfect because my scalp really needed some TLC <laughs> um, because like I said my scalp it gets dry really easily so I love the shampoo I kind of use a lot probably too much you really only need like a dime size because it suds up really well but it also left my hair feeling like um, it didn't leave my hair feeling stripped which is what I find with a lot of shampoos anyways love their shampoo love the conditioner um the conditioner had a good amount of slip too my hair is still wet so i couldn't decide what i wanted to do with my hair so what i just ended up doing is shampoo condition added in my moisturizer and a little bit of gel with the hair oil while i was in the shower so that way so that way it was quick and easy and my hair was already moisturized but I just layered all of my products in, brushed it down. I used a dimming brush so there was no lumps or anything. Don't mind my baby hairs growing back in. Um, so it's really smooth and I just put it in a bun. It'll dry somewhat stretched out and it's out of the way and moisturized. It's kind of like a protective style. So what I'm gonna do is just put this on and tomorrow i'll figure out how i'm going to style it i'm not going anywhere tomorrow actually i am going to a baby shower on sunday so maybe i'll show you guys Jaden. i'll show you guys how i end up styling my hair since it'll be a little bit stretched i don't know if i'm, I'm going to keep it back or end up doing like a style and wear my hair out because i know it's going to be hot so Ooh. 